Cho Gim Trungpa, a multifaceted and enigmatic figure, wove a complex tapestry of spirituality, innovation, controversy, and transformation throughout his life. Born in 1939 in Tibet, he was recognized as the 11th Trungpa Tulku, an incarnate lama, destined for a spiritual journey that would leave an indelible mark on Tibetan Buddhism's transmission to the West. Early life and escape, Trungpa's childhood was steeped in the rigors of monastic training and Buddhist scholarship. However, the political turmoil engulfing Tibet in the late 1950s forced him to undertake a treacherous journey to India in 1959. His escape through the treacherous Himalayan terrain symbolized his unwavering determination to preserve Tibetan Buddhism amidst adversity. Adapting to a new land, exiled from his homeland, Trumpa ventured into India and later to the United Kingdom, where he sought to deepen his studies and understand the cultural currents of the Western world. This journey marked the initial steps toward his vision of blending the wisdom of Tibetan Buddhism with the insights of Western philosophy and psychology. Pioneering a new approach, Trumpa's journey to the West culminated in the foundation of Vajradhatu, an organization aimed at disseminating Tibetan Buddhist teachings in the Western context. He introduced a groundbreaking approach that sought to strip away cultural barriers, translating ancient wisdom into accessible language. His teachings, often infused with humor, challenged conventional paradigms and encouraged students to confront their habitual patterns. The founding of Shamhala, one of Trungpa's most enduring legacies was the establishment of Shamhala, a global community centered around the integration of spiritual practice into everyday life. The Shamhala teachings emphasized mindfulness, meditation, and compassion as means to navigate the complexities of modern existence. Trungpa's vision sought to harmonize personal well-being with societal engagement, promoting the idea of an enlightened society. Controversies and teachings, Trungpa's unconventional teaching methods generated both acclaim and consternation. His use of crazy wisdom, a method to disrupt habitual patterns of thought, challenged his students to break free from ego-based constructs. This approach led to controversies, with critics questioning the ethical dimensions of his actions. Nonetheless, Trumpa's teachings often transcended the traditional boundaries of spiritual guidance, fostering deep introspection and transformation. Literary and academic contributions, Trumpa's impact extended beyond the classroom. He penned numerous works, including Shamhala, The Sacred Path of the Warrior, which outlined his vision of an enlightened society, and Cutting Through Spiritual Materialism, a critique of superficial spirituality. His literary contributions delved into the core tenets of his teachings, encouraging readers to explore their inherent wisdom and transcend societal conditioning. Legacy and Passing Chogyam Trungpa's sudden passing in 1987 marked the end of a remarkable journey that had traversed continents and cultural boundaries. His legacy, however, was far from finite. His teachings continued to flourish through the efforts of his students, who established centers and organizations dedicated to preserving and transmitting his insights. Impact on Tibetan Buddhism and beyond, Trumpa's impact extended beyond his immediate sphere. He founded Naropa University in Boulder, Colorado, where Eastern spirituality intertwined with Western academia, catalyzing a new approach to education. His innovative methods influenced generations of spiritual teachers, fostering a lineage that persists today. In summary, Chogyam Trumpa's life embodied the complexities of a visionary thinker, bridging ancient wisdom and contemporary challenges. His journey from the monastic traditions of Tibet to the establishment of Shamhala in the West symbolized his transformative influence. While his legacy remains a subject of debate, his teachings, literary works, and innovative approach to spirituality continue to inspire seekers across cultures, resonating as a bridge between the spiritual heritage of the East and the modern complexities of the West.